Technically, can it still be skirt talk if I have on pants? <laughs> when you are pants, so okay, it's okay. fine. It's I just pants wanted to know. So, hey, my pants and skirts. Hey, YouTube. You be Karen. I'm back, back, back with another video. But this time, I'm here with Shell Bell. Hey. And Rudy. Hey. You guys remember them from previous videos. Hey, if you are everybody. a current pants and skirts, then you know my cousins, my favorites. And we are back with um an edition of my skirt talk. So, I hope you guys stay tuned for that. And I hope you guys sit back and enjoy. Technically, can it still be skirt talk if I have on pants? <laughs> well, you are pants, so okay, it's okay. fine. It's I just pants wanted to know. Skirts, so, but it's skirts. still. <laughs> <laughs> I wear the skirts in the relationships. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Yikes. We're going to talk about a couple of current events. And um, now this is probably going to piss both of them off, but I don't even care because this is Unique's way. This is, this is just what it is. So here we are. My favorite person is home from jail. My favorite per person is home from jail, and I'm so excited. My favorite rapper, which is Kodak Black. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure that it's really him? <laughs> I'm hearing it's a clone. Oh, wow. Don't do that. <laughs> Stop, Don't do Stop. that. Don't come Stop. for my Kodak. Y'all little... know that I love me some Kodak. I have always loved me some Kodak. If That's you don't watch my Lisa Simpson. previous oh my videos God, in the past, y'all know that I love me some Kodak. <laughs> Don't do that. Nice. Listen, he come out here. He on better vibes and all that. He got himself together. He doing better things. You know what I mean? He is give just, me two months. Don't do that. He is engaged. You know what I mean? He has a fiance and nice. all that. He did come out here and come after JT. He did come after JT. Oh, now that ain't good. For what? <laughs> on Valentine's Day, he was like, he wanted to take her on a date. Oh, oh, oh. He, he, wanted date. he was like singing to her and stuff. Shot. It was so cute. Was I, was she is not having I love, I love Kodak Black, though. I really do. But it was just so amazing to see him in that spirit of being like romantic and stuff. Just like calling out to a girl. You know what I mean? Just shooting his shot. You know what I mean? Like Shell said. It, I, it was nice to see. I love me some Kodak. But anyway, on to better news. Um, speaking of people coming home, um, Bobby Smarter came home. Hey. Amazing, right? Yeah. Hey. Like, listen, he did all that time. And it's crazy because this one over here, she's talking about, so yeah, Bobby's murder. Um, what did he get locked up for? <laughs> <laughs> Why is your face like that? Fix your face. Um, I was just thinking of something. I thought when you said came home the first time and your he favorite rapper, I you. thought you were talking about Bobby Smarter. <laughs> and I'm like, and I'm like, like, I'm like he has two us songs. Up. He has like but two she songs. Us up no, she did that. No. I'm like, what? No, but so, um, yeah, Bobby Smarter, he came home or whatever, and I was telling her that, um, yeah, the reason why he got, like, indicted and, like, his charges and, like, his case even, Stop like... rapping about what you're doing. Basically, he was, like, rapping oh, yeah, I heard his, about songs, yeah, like, his yeah. songs, like, his songs is like, He's um, Mitch just came home about a week ago, a week ago. Oh, that was the shit, no was shit. Like, <laughs> that was the shit. Does like, YM and um, 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 Melly ring a bell? got murder on my mind he exactly. killed his friends and then he, oh got, he, he rapped about it exactly so like it's the same thing you know what i mean but yeah he's home and that's just amazing so welcome home bobby smurder you know what i mean kudos to welcome you home. hopefully you do your thing and all that don't be letting but, the couch chases get you because you know 50 done already said what he had to say okay so i get it um with him he didn't he just was getting in the game but and it's I like yeah when he when he went to jail like he was just at the top height of his career i don't know if he can hold up to that now because it's just mm. like it's a whole different era um mm -hmm. on top of that it's just like nobody really knew his capabilities um mm -hmm. they have like drill music now who knows if he can like rap with the new york drill music um mm -hmm. and before he went in he wasn't a martyr so i'm tired of like the culture making people martyrs because they go to jail or they die mm. you gotta yeah. come on with it i don't know i'm just saying you better come That's on with it valid point. Okay. Valid point. that part <laughs> He's a legend. He went to jail. Sorry. Let me stop. Don't do that. Now, it's a couple other things going on out here. and um, But um, one thing that I do want to bring up is um, the Coming to America movie just came out. Coming to America too. Yeah. It's been, it was like, in the movie, it was like a 30-year difference. And he had a son. And you know what I mean? His son was supposed to come king. And you know what I mean? <laughs> then he had a daughter who wanted to become queen. And like, it was, you know what I mean? It was real competitive. I, it was, I started it was watching very, the like, series. Different. It was unique. 
Oh, did y'all watch the series? They no. had a series, and I had started watching the series. It was just of the kids. Like, oh, okay. And oh. it was really, it was, it began to be dope. It was like a bunch of black excellence. It was like a bunch of talented black actors in it. Um, it was really, it was like a modernized coming to America. Nice. So, oh, wow. Okay. I didn't even know that it existed. I didn't either. Yeah. I didn't either. I didn't it was on BT, um, probably Plus or something. I like got that. You know. Okay. But, I'll check that out. Um, okay. I'm excited <laughs> to watch. I know you've watched it. Did you watch it? Yeah, I definitely did. I haven't watch watched it. it yet. It was so I didn't watch funny. The full it was movie, so though. Funny. I watched it. And it was like, yeah. it just, it, and it was funny. Like, it was funny, but it was like, it made you laugh. Like, when I say it's funny, I meant like, there was parts where it was like it was relatable and then it was like even stuff that was still because i don't want to tell too much because he didn't watch it but it was still stuff that was still relatable about things Coming that happened America. back then okay. so if you watch the first one it was just like yo oh my god even to the point of the characters coming back you okay know what I mean? certain people because i was even hearing that um mcdowell the dad Remember Lisa's dad? Yeah. Um, he wasn't even supposed to be a part of the movie. Oh, and he was okay. in it. And That's then it was dope. like McDonald's over there. Wait, you know Rick what Ross I mean? said, they said Rick Ross like, said, cool. if you're going to use my house, you're going to put Yo, me in Yo, funny, because they had Rick Ross in the movie, right? But he used like a crazy accent. And I'm just like, oh my God. He was talking like he was from Zimbabwe. Oh, oh it my was God. so funny. Like, that was another part that was funny. You know what I mean? Dangerous. General EZ. We have just been informed King Akin has returned from America with a son. A son? Of course, Arsenio Hall was so funny. Oh, of course, he was amazing. Oh, okay. Eddie Murphy, now, me? Eddie, just like they were back then. Honestly, me, I'm never too prone to, like, movies that have, like, a bunch of celebrity, like, um, guests, like, cameos and stuff it like that. Lot. Because I, mean, what I, saw, it I haven't a seen a good movie with a bunch of celebrity um, cameos since you got served basically mm. i mean stomp the yard was pretty good but it wasn't that many like rappers Singles. or mm. singers or stuff like that in the mm. movie so i don't know i hope it, hopefully it's really good i can't wait to watch it oh wow mm. well you have to definitely check that out real because it's like a definitely a must see so um i hope you guys um enjoyed this video i hope you guys enjoyed your time here if you guys are not a part of my pants and skirts crew then what are you waiting for subscribe don't forget to hit the bell so you don't miss any of Kevin's videos unique hey. <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys enjoyed your time here until next time unique shell bell and hey, Rue. we bell. all will be audi 5000 peace